What I did before this, um, I used to do the social business. Basically, my background was retail. My master's in applied GIS. Just come out of uh, sick form. Yes, yeah, so I'm an artist. Uh, doing kitchens and interior design. Yeah, I had a bakery and coffee shop. I'd done private yachts for 10 years. In six years, being a primary school teacher. I uh, studied music at university. Kind of just been working in minimum wage, you know, customer service. I'd just been turned down for yet another job. I studied software engineering. I worked as an education officer. My master's uh, at Birmingham in translation. I was doing a PhD in chemistry. Math student at the University of Birmingham. I was working for probation as a court officer. Working DHR and now I'm here. Hi, I'm Chris from the School of Code. I started it because there's a ton of money, jobs and opportunity in technology, but that doesn't always reach everyone. So we've started a 16 week boot camp that takes people from beginner all the way through to coding pro and into software development jobs. And this is our attempt to get more and different types of people benefiting from technology. Sounds kind of cliche really, but it's, it's really changed my life. It's been a journey, mate. It's been fun and we're still going. Um, lots of doors have been opened and lots of new ideas have been put to us. In the space of the past 11 weeks, the amount of information I've learned about the languages of HTML, CSS, JavaScript, all the frameworks that go with it is just immense. We have covered more than I ever thought possible in 16 weeks. HTML and CSS in the first couple of weeks, which before we started, I had um, no clue about at all. Chris, our CEO, takes us out of our comfort zones all the time, every single day, but it's turned out to be really, really good for us because that's how I feel I've made so much progress. I've learned that you shouldn't try to do um, everything by yourself. I was a shy person when I came here, but right now I feel confident. I can yeah, communicate very good with the people. And yeah, the team working is the top thing that I learned here. This is why I never thought tech was for me. Because the idea of tech, the stereotype is, is an individual working by themselves, which is something that I can never do. I need to be able to be around people. I need to be able to talk. I need to be able to socialise. So that's why I always stayed away from the tech side. To be comfortable being uncomfortable is what Chris has tried to instill in everyone. And I think that's been the case during the bootcamp. I think the team working side of things has been really fun. Um, everyone on the bootcamp just got along really, really well and worked together supporting each other. Before the course, I might not have said that I was the sort of person who loves being working in teams and working with those new people, but I've just had so much fun working with everyone, keep switching it up and it's just really fun. Being able to just integrate into any kind of team, like we kind of have pair programming and then we go into different teams and that's absolutely easy. Then um, laying out your um, jobs that you need to do and dividing that between people, but then coming back together as a team saying, Oh, what don't you know? Let's help you, let's do this. So I guess teamwork has massive, massive um, increased. The broad knowledge or curriculum that is actually being taught at the bootcamp, varying, going from HTML all the way to advanced JavaScript, to Node and setting up servers, then to again some, uh, some JavaScript frameworks such as React and so on and so forth. So yeah, it's, it's, it's been hectic but nice. I learned how to be more confident. Due to the presentations we've had, I used to be like a terrible public speaker, but just presenting in a small group of um, people has really boosted my speaking skills. I'm just, just going to be something that, you know, just be normal, just come in the morning, go back in the evening and stuff. But it was more than that. I actually learned more than I thought I would. I thought when it, we come into this, it would just be um, learning code um, day in, day out, um, and then having people around to help you learn it. It brought a lot of teamwork into it. Um, we've had so that you'd learn something and some people get it, some people wouldn't. And it's meant that it's not just been straight from the boot camp. it's people in your, that are in, in your shoes that are helping you go along, which is really useful. Really nice getting into the sort of the Birmingham tech scene because I literally didn't know an HTML tag when I started this course. And now HTML is fundamental to all the work we've been doing. Six 
16 weeks ago, I didn't really know where I'd be now. Um, but, you know, I'm a lot further along than I thought it would be. I definitely really underestimated how hard it would be. Learning like a new skill from scratch is like super hard no matter what it is. Going to the hackathon that we went to in London, um, talking to some second year computer scientists, like, yeah, they've learned other languages like PHP and Java or whatever, but our level of knowledge in JavaScript is much higher than theirs, and they've been doing it for two years. So just the intensity of what we've learned is insane. We were told that we would be full stack JavaScript developers by the end of 16 weeks, and to be honest, I didn't believe that. Um, but I mean, here we are. I don't think I would have learned as much as I have now, so far. I would have thought, you know, I would have brushed upon HTML, CSS, JavaScript, and possibly a backend language, but we've over-exceeded that. To become an efficient JavaScript full-stack developer, and I reckon the bootcamp has led me and set me up for achieving that goal. It's really exciting to kind of know that I'm going for a career that's full of innovation. We've all got a really good foundation for starting a career in tech. If I were to sum up my bootcamp experience in one word, it would definitely be life-changing. Amazing. Challenging. It's unbelievable. Moving. Intense. It would be hard. Really mind-blowing. Extreme. Difficult. It's phenomenal. It's intense. It's been relentless. Immense. It's a bit overwhelming. Challenging. Amazing. It's awesome. 